And I hope you've enjoyed this painting half as much as we have. It's a lot of fun. Teach you a great deal. We interrupt this program to bring you a live special report from NASA, where Public Relations Representative Charles Cady is about to take the podium. Hello, people of Earth. I am NASA Public Relations Representative Chuck Cady. As you already know, America's very own visual artist, Donnie Smoots, is about to become the very first artist in all of mankind to have his own art show on the moon. This is a historic moment in both space exploration, the arts, and why America is still number one. Mm -hmm. uh, without further delay, we are now live via satellite with our own visual artist, Donnie Smoots. Donnie, are you there? Mr. K Wait, Mr. Katie, are you there? Can you see me? Can you hear me? Okay, good. Yep. I got gotcha. you. Uh, excellent. Uh, welcome, Donnie. We have you live on camera with viewers tuning in from all around the world. How are you? So pumped about everybody getting on board on this whole art installation I'm doing here on the moon. Right. Well, nonetheless, we'll be taking questions from both the press as well as live call-ins from Skype. Uh, if you don't mind, we're just going to jump in with our first question. And, uh... Here, here. Oh, yes, here, right here. here. Mm -hmm. Dylan Andover, New York Times. Probably heard of it. Does Don have any famous artists that he looks up to or just admires? The biggest artists I look up to right now are probably, obviously, Salvador Dali, Magritte, Max Ernst, MC Escher, and that's about it right now. All right. Well, how about our next question then? And we're looking at uh, question. Question. Yes, the gentleman. Okay, yeah. Excuse yeah, gentleman, Italian. the Italian gentleman. Uh, yeah, how are you? Tony Micheloni, Bambini Magazine. Uh, I have a question for the uh, Danny Smuts. Uh, uh, the art. What does he like? What does he not like? What does he like to taste? I just want to know. Artwork that I'm into right now is definitely surrealism. The last three mm -hmm. to five, maybe mm -hmm. ten years, I've really uh, dove into that whole world. I'm also doing installations mm -hmm. and more productions. And speaking of surrealism. Thank you. We're just going to keep moving at this point, folks. All right, so we have, let's see, next question. Uh, yeah, up front here, man, the brown suede, yes. Tad Westmoreland, Art Weekly. What mm -hmm. other forms of art? Yeah, the from Osawatomie, Kansas. Yeah, yeah, just one second here. Uh, it seems we have a young lady from Osawatomie, Kansas calling in. Donnie, I'm told she has a few questions for you. Kayla, go ahead. I just have a few questions for Mr. Smoot. Oh, hey, Kayla. Where are you located right now? Right now, I live in Chicago, Illinois. Have you ever been there? All right, now, and a, uh, Donnie, she has a second question. Kayla, go ahead. Do you listen to a specific band or artist while you're creating a piece? The biggest band I listen to right now, and it's only because I have one CD I brought with me, is Radiohead. Ugh. All right, we're going to move forward with our, with our next question here. And let's see, let's see, uh, yeah. Hi, yes, uh, Sonia DeSanio, People Magazine. Is there any kind of procedure Donnie goes through before creating a piece? The procedure I go through when I do paint, obviously I need inspiration. I go to galleries or museums, and then usually if it's commission work or just out of my head, I do some sketches, and then I go right into the painting, which I usually throw down acrylic paint on canvas and move it around a bit, get it watered down, and whatever I see in the actual painting, I pull out and detail out and more abstract at first, and then it goes into more realistic later on. No drugs used whatsoever. Say no to drugs. Let's keep rolling here. Okay, next question. Yes, you in front. Oh, uh, oui, je demande une question pour Danny. Uh, Adèle Petit pour le Femme Actuelle. Uh, what does Danny like to do in his free time? I travel a lot. I go to museums around the country. I go hiking a lot in the mountains which has nothing on this beautiful place, as you can clearly see. Uh, merci. Well, yes, you with the cat. Oh, yes, uh, Kathy Carlson from Modern Cat Magazine. I was just wondering, why doesn't Donnie have more cats in his paintings? Did she say cat? Is there a cat in the audience? What? Mm. Okay, uh, no, I don't. I don't put more cats in my paintings. I, I guess I should. There is a demographic for that, and cats are popular right now. But no, I don't put cats in my paintings, and I probably won't. Okay, all right, yeah. Uh, so next question here. Uh, so we're going from, let's see, let's see, let's see. Yes, you with the, um, the frosted tip mullets. Um, <laughs> the 80s called, they want their hairstyle back. <laughs> Thank you so much. Go ahead with your question. 
I'm Kelly Travis from LA Times. Uh, sorry, not to interrupt. Well, just one more time. Is that a real tan or is that a spray tan? Because it's December and you're orange. Sick! So, has Donnie ever had any controversial pieces that he's ever created that are like mad sick? Yes, I have had some controversy over some paintings I've done in the past. Wicked! Such as my Obama painting, which got some protesters outside of a show one time. And one guy came in drunk and sliced open one of my paintings with a uh, pocket knife, which was painful, but awesome! Dude! Bro! Next, next, next. Uh, no, can't leave me out. No. Uh, yes. Hi, I'm Sunshine McInshaw from Juxtapose Magazine. And, like, I'd like to know, when's Donnie's birthday? Well, it's, okay, it's a question. Um, Mr. Smoots. My birthday is January 26, 1988, and I was born in Iola, Kansas. That's really rad. It is rad. Oh, I have one more, one more question. Uh, Kayla, go ahead. If you could be remembered for anything, what would you like to be remembered for? Mm, brilliant. Donnie? What I'd like to be remembered for? I would love to be remembered for my constant drive to always create beauty, no matter what time or place, and making sure that creating art is always at the center of who I am and why I'm on this earth, or moon for that matter. Excellent. Um, I think on that note, we will end the press conference. Thank you so much, for everyone, for being here. Thank you uh, to our sponsors at Starbucks, Chipotle, and the Facebook. Um, also, thank you to America, the American public, and uh, everyone else. Thank you to visual artist Donnie Smoots. All right, guys, thank you so much for all the amazing questions, and especially Kayla from Osawatomie, Kansas. Thank you for letting me be a part of your project. I got to go. And uh, thank you so much. We appreciate it. All right, have a good night. Good night, good luck, America. Yep. <laughs>